It's, this shit is gonna be real. This is can be real. I can't believe I'm pit. I can't believe I'm actually gotta be doing this right now. What up, it's your boy T Bear? Um, this gotta be the most heart breaking in news in sports history right now, especially so early in this year. Especially after what occurred last night in NBA. Anyway, it's all over. I mean, you haven't heard it in, uh, then you're in it now. Uh, reportedly, a helicopter crash took place in Calabasas, California today. And no survivor among one of them that was killed dead in the helicopter crash was NBA legend Kobe Bryant at the age 41. This can't be real, for real. I'm like really th just praying that this is a joke, a hoax, something like that. Saying it was a mistake or something because, oh my god. Plus, I gotta re-upload this on my main page because I'm gonna think I'm still in lockdown. But anyway, man, I followed this man since hearing about him getting drafted to high school. I mean, you know, I was, I was get some some of the way, but I still admire his work as an NBA player. Just you know, this was he played for the Lakers. You know, at the time you hate the Lakers, and I was a Sixers fan. I'm saying still am. You know, I'm fucking with the Lakers right now because LeBron, but still follow his career. And I mean, I watched him getting the eight, his final game. Uh, watch him, we got the 80s and all 81 points. Watch him since day one, man. Oh my god. You would never think somebody legend like this, like him, you thought he would live long and as long as Jordan's living right now. <sighs> man. This is fucking devastating. It's not even funny. Of course, that should be funny, but it's it's just uh, so unreal. Like we're, I'm really saying that I really saying R.I.P. Kobe Bryant right now. I rather say that when he was like way old or something like that, or never say, have to say it. I'll be done doing reactions before saying. But oh my god, I know a lot of people heard. Shout out prayers to his wife and family. First and foremost, though, his father, his mother. Uh, Jelly Bean, legendary bus player Jelly Bean, Joe Bryant, and his fans, his friends, especially LeBron, after he just did what he did last night, passing his homie, uh, passing Kobe, that's his homie, his road dog, his bro, passing his scoring record and everything. Oh my god, we just talked about this man, everybody was talking about this man because of what's going on with LeBron scoring his his record, but you would not think the next day we say talk about this man being dead, man. Oh my god. It's just, just wow. Just wow. <sighs> R.I.P. Kobe Bryant. Thank you for years, and we surprised says since everybody thought when we had through his retirement, but we we're saying again, thank you for years of hard work and dedication to the NBA and basketball in general. Um, inspired a lot of people in basketball. Hearts out to your daughters who are on or virtually following your path as well too in basketball. Your wife, your family, your friends, everybody. Prayers to them. And also RP to the others who was lost in that um, helicopter crash too. We can't just single out somebody yeah, just because he's a celebrity, you know what I mean? Lives were lost regardless though, but damn. Yeah, this is just, 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 please tell me, like, I, I'm hoping that, like, I'm still hoping, like, somebody, it's news coming saying that it wasn't, he wasn't one of those mistake, or something, but till then, man, what a tragedy. What a real, what a serious tragedy, and so far the biggest tragedy in 2020 right now. Definitely one of the biggest right now. It's your boy T Bear signing off. One love.
this 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 thing is getting worse and worse by the hours. So he's already talking and saying that they thought Rick Fox was one of them the passengers killed. But thank God that's false, but kinda wish his other one was false. So amongst others that I just mentioned about the Kobe, RP Kobe was killed in the um helicopter crash. Well, I just found out that one of the other passengers of the helicopter crash was his uh, 13-year-old daughter, uh, Gigi. Yeah, it just make it more sad. Even, even more, more sad. Because she was actually going to follow in his footstep, balling and everything. This one just got me in tears right now. Like, I was going to shed tears, but this one almost got me in tears because can't imagine losing a daughter, especially somebody that had a potential to become a star soon before they even got a chance to become who they are. I'm saying we saw, and I think yesterday I saw my his daughter, his daughter is falling in his footsteps. I think the older one is, is falling too, but man. This is sad uh, right now. Huh. This going I'm gonna add this as a bonus to the um video when I reel up a little on my main page, but um for now I'm gonna add it right now so folks won't come like, oh you know it's what door died too, yeah, I just found it out. Fuck. This is only the first month of twenty twenty and we're getting crazy deaths like this. This got me scared. I ain't gonna find this got me scared and I don't know. Mm -hmm. <sighs> yeah, it's mad blowing up on man show. Oh yeah, it's just Tyson Chandler breaks down crying. Yeah, I don't blame him. Probably looked up to him and everything too. Prize inspiration, especially him come out of high school as well too, but oh my god, this is just so sad. Like, this is so sad. Like, I'm really wishing this, everything is just like a hoax. This can't be on real, like, but it's sadly real right now. I, I'm i not sure I can't do any other reaction vids right now because I'm so, like, heartbreaking and sick to my stomach and frightened right now. Um, I said for later on today, I probably won't do it, have time anyway because we're on a rumble cool moon today. Um,. But, wow, this is just fucking sad. Anyways, your boy T-Bird signing off from love.